A battle ensues outside of Sinope, and Alexios is defeated and eventually captured. With their emperor being held hostage, the Sultan Kekus I demands that the Trebizondians hand over the city in exchange for Alexios. The defenders refuse to hand over the city, and they suggest that one of Alexios' children would presently make a good emperor. This was probably received with mixed feelings from Alexios, who surely wanted to live. This was definitely received with frustration from Kekus I, but he came up with a solution to the siege. His soldiers, along with Alexios, drew closer to the walls of Sinope. The confused defenders stared, unknowing of the intentions of the Sultan. Once Alexios was deemed to be within a good eyesight of Sinope, his captors started to torture him. There are no descriptions of the severity of the torture, but it can be assumed that it was drastic and not short. The horrified Trebizondians looked as their emperor was seemingly dying for them. The sources state that Emperor Alexios was tortured several times, before the shock garrison of Sinope surrendered on November 1st of 1214. 